For skin cancer, we work with our skin cancer team, which encompasses dermatology, surgical oncology, facial plastic and reconstructive surgery, head and neck surgery, and uh, medical oncology. We work as a team. We meet weekly to discuss new, new complex cases, and we make sure that treatments are tailored to the individual patient, and they're going to get the best possible care. Our focus is both on treating the cancer and in providing the best functional and cosmetic outcome. One of the most difficult things about all cancers of the head and neck, especially skin cancers, is that they're highly visible and they're highly disfiguring. And although we all don't want to be vain, this is the way we uh, in represent ourselves to the world and this is a key part of how we envision ourselves. So our ability to both make sure we can function well and look as well as we want is a key aspect of what we do. In our division, in facial plastic and reconstructive surgery, we see a large volume of advanced cutaneous malignancies of the head and neck. The three main types of skin cancers are basal cell carcinoma, squamous cell carcinoma, and melanoma. Melanoma is treated with surgery, whereas basal cell carcinoma and squamous cell carcinoma are treated with either traditional surgery or a special technique called Mohs surgery. Mohs surgery is performed by specially trained dermatologists and allows them to take the smallest amount of healthy tissue and preserve the most amount of skin and function. So you want a surgeon who's board certified. That means they have special expertise in this area. But you also want a surgeon who sees a large volume of these defects. At Mount Sinai, in the Division of Facial Plastic and Reconstructive Surgery, we do over many hundreds of these reconstructions a year. We are a high volume referral center for this. We have great outcomes, and we measure outcomes both by before and after photos, by specific outcome measurements looking at patients' function after surgery. The biggest advantage of Mount Sinai is our team approach. We have a huge skin cancer team that involves both facial plastic and reconstructive surgery, head and neck surgery, surgical oncology, dermatology, radiation oncology, and medical oncology. This is a team that meets weekly. We discuss all of our complex cases and make sure that the care is individualized and tailored to patients. Patients should expect that they should heal over the weeks and months following surgery. Their scars will mature. Scars can take many months to mature, but over time they will fade. They will um, be closely followed, both for the cosmetic aspects of the reconstruction, but also to make sure that their cancer does not return. For more information, please see our website at mountsinai.org slash facialplastics.